Fly Storm Boxing Boots have now been launched and here on fit to box channel an exclusive first full review. Hello and welcome to fit to box channel I'm Coach Simon and here on fit to box channel I bring you all things boxing equipment. As you know recently I've done a first look at this boot, the Fly Storm Boxing Boot, just launched, absolutely stunning. I did a first look video on the black pair. I also did a first look video on this beautiful blue, red and white pair. And I think that they are absolutely stunning. So, as you can see, these are the two colorways that they've launched on that launch date. I know that there's gonna be more colors to come and I can't wait for those new colors to come out because I think the boot really does lend itself to lots and lots of different colorways. So as I bring that round for you, really stunning in the black on black and with that sole there and I'll come on to that. And these are very comfortable, very lightweight boots. Now, when it comes to the weight, I've weighed these. These are a UK 11, and they come out at around 13 and a half ounces each. Okay, so that is a lightweight boxing boot. As I bring this round, I have found them true to size as well. So I'm a UK 11, and these are UK 11, and they fit me perfectly. And now some people in the comments and some of my viewers have said about the sort of similarity to the original Nike Hyper KO ones there. And I can see that similarity. Definitely, I thought this was a fantastic boot. And I think that these are fantastic boots as well. One thing I will say though is this boot always had a problem when it came to the sole, that front toe end and also a little bit of balding going on. Let me tell you that this boot is going to have no such problems when it comes to the sole. And so this boot is an improvement on that boot. And everyone who knows this channel knows how much I love that boot. Of course, that boot, the Nike Hyper KO uh, 1 original, is no longer available. It has been discontinued. So if you love this boot, this is a fantastic update on that type of boot. So let me bring it around, show you. You got that durable sole as it comes around and sort of you can see how it how it sort of curls up there. You've got that Velcro on the front there as well, which obviously is a little higher from the boots like the Hypercale original that had it there. Obviously the Reebok book they had one there and you I did a review recently of some Adams boxing boots where they had a Velcro there and a Velcro there and Fly have done their own thing and they've gone with one right in the middle at the front of that foot. Show you the tongue there and I really do think these boots look spectacular from whatever angle that you look at them they do look great. Obviously I did a review recently of the Adidas Ultra and one of the things that I didn't like about the Adidas Ultra was the fact that on the inside it didn't look as good as on the outside and these boots look fantastic on both the inside and the outside and whatever angle I caught myself when I was in the gym if I was looking in the mirror and I turned around whatever angle I was at I thought that these boots looked fantastic so again some people will prefer the black on black now when it comes to the sizes as I say I'm an 11, these are true to size, they are an 11. Um, the sizes that they've got at the minute are 5 to 12 and no half sizes. So they are coming out with some more sizes as well. So again, that is great news for those people that don't sit on the full size uh, on, when it comes to shoes and, and, and boots. If you are a half size, I do think that that will be coming soon. So when it comes to wide feet, um, I would say that these are suitable for narrow feet, normal feet, and slightly wider feet. If you've got really wide feet, I'm not so sure these will be the boots. But if you're a little bit above average when it comes to the wideness of your feet, I do think that these will be okay for you. Also, on the inside, they have got uh, a slightly raised arch. Okay, so if you've got flat feet, 
Uh, it's not like a really pronounced arch, it is a slight raise, so you will know whether or not that's going to be any good for your feet. Uh, my own feet, I've got like a, an arch on my feet, and my feet are pretty normal feet when it comes to sort of the width as well. So let's just bring that round and let's get up onto the screen the Fit to Box ratings card. So, fit to box rating, ratings card, you can see it is a GB, a great British company, an English company, and these boots made in China. Style, 98, stunning style, love these boots how they look. Comfort, 97, very, very comfortable boots, really comfortable um, to wear, really enjoy using them. Durability. 98 that sole really does does add to the durability or the overall durability of these boots performance 98 that is a superb score when it comes to performance really love using them as i say really been impressed sole 98 again blown away i like this on this particular one where you've got the red and the white and then on the black, obviously you've got the full black um, sole there, but that is really, really durable, and I can see that lasting for a hell of a long time. Value for money, 95, that is at 165 UK pounds, so value for money, 95. So that gives an overall score of 97.3. That is five fit to box stars, that is rated fit to box the best and that leaves me only one thing left to do and that is a new fit to box boots champion five fit to box stars classified as the best 97.3 check out my boots list on my website fit to box channel.com where you can see Obviously, these are now the new champion, but you can see all the other boots and brands are rated and ranked in order on my website. I spend a hell of a long time putting that together, and I have to say, I tried uh, a pair of these, which were a prototype, uh, quite a little while ago, and I loved them. And I didn't even want to send those back to Fly. And what Fly did was they took on board some feedback that I gave them, they came back, and they have improved their boots on those prototypes that I absolutely loved. And then they've sent through these and I think that they are superb. I really do. Really great what they've done. And I've got to give credit where credit is due. I give out my titles, the fit to box titles, to only the most deserving of equipment. I also only give out fit to box stars to the very, very best equipment, whether that's one star all the way up to five. And repeatedly, no matter what fly bring out, they always seem to be able to land their products in that top, top tier of my ratings. I love the brand, but I also love the consistency that comes with fly and what they do. And whether it's gloves or groin guards or head guards uh, or even their clothing, absolutely superb. And now they've topped it off with, in my opinion, the best boots on the market in the world. So I hope you enjoyed that. Please like and subscribe to Fit2Box channel and I shall speak to you soon.